Good morning, Chapleton. It is Monday um, after Independence. And just wanted to say to everybody a happy Independence. I know it's a day after, but happy Independence Day, Jamaica. 60 years. 60 years. You know, I was listening to the concert, the call that was done by the Flock Group of Crossroads Church in Chapleton and many other guests and I was so blessed and I was thinking about the song right here and I just want to tie it in because what I do on Monday mornings is I take Jamaican songs saying stories and just weave them into spiritual principles so let's listen to Toots and the Matos I'll Never Grow Old Yes, man, that is Toots and the Matos. You know something? You know that Toots, Frederick Toots Hibbert, I think that's his official name. He grew up in church, you know. Yes, man. That was where he got his sound. That was where he got his rhythm, his music. And I thought about him because as I listened to this rhythm, that's why many of us jump to it, you know, <laughs> even if we church. It just reminds you of something you'd say. I love that part. All right, let me see if I can do it. Never, 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 never. I had the campus do it last year, and I remember Sean Day and Antoine, they just took it on to do this. This is such a classic Jamaican song, but I was fascinated that, Toots grew up in church. That's where he got his, um, the feel of something that he knew he could give to people. It was in church. And as I listened to the call last night, I heard the youth, young people, getting something from the system, the ecology, the fellowship of church. And it is Jesus. You know, the word of God says, I know some may have difficulty with this. I don't have any difficulty with it. Every good and perfect gift comes from God. Now, don't tell me that this song here, I'll never. Don't tell me that that's not a, a gift. That's not a good gift. So sometimes we want to say, why them shouldn't be singing that. There was nothing wrong with the words of the song. I'll never grow old until I found my love. Nothing. It was a good gift. And, and sometimes I wonder if we haven't caused the good gifts to leave the church. Because we don't know how to appreciate or handle the gifts people have. Because it may not sound like what we're used to to the sound to be that makes sense if sometimes we don't push the gifts out when they're meant to minister not only to the world but to the body of christ it has taken the church a long time to get to a place where we realize that there is beauty in some of the things we have allowed to leave but that's not really my point that's not really my point I was just looking last night at the youth as they practiced in the call. For those of you who are hearing this and you may not know what that is, Sister Denise Levy, along with a team of leaders in Chapleton, launched last night the first of what we know would be many 
um, cultural displays of arts, talent, giftings, and they showcased the youth. And it was saying that they're responding to the call of God on their lives. And what a beautiful showcase it was in dance, in music. Um, I think it's time we all answer the call. We answer the call to get youth to understand that they are precious and they're used by God. And I don't know the form it may come in, but I'm going to ask us once the message doesn't change and the integrity of the message of the gospel of Jesus Christ is preserved. Let's allow the youth to answer the call. Let's allow them to answer the call. I was so touched by what I saw. We're calling them the flock group. Flock means future leaders of Chapleton. I was so touched by what I saw them showing last night. And I'm thinking about Toots and the Matos. I don't know if Toots ended up seeing that his gift was from God and, and understanding how he got it. I know he died in 2020 and many people mourned. I don't want it to be that our youth have to leave the church to find an audience. I don't I don't want that to be the case. So after I watch last night, you know, after I watch last night, I prayed, I said, God let Dorica and all of the others who were singing, let them realize there is a place for them in the church where the gifts are appreciated. And from there, they can send it out to the world. This was a sound that came from the church. I'll never grow old. And then I found myself listening to the words that he said. I'll never grow old. And I thought about two things. I thought about Jesus encouraging us to never grow old in how we see the kingdom. You remember, I shared that scripture before. He said that if you... He called a little child before them. And he said, if you become like a little child, you will see the kingdom. It's one of the famous well-loved scriptures I love to share. Forgive me for not looking up the reference, but I think it's Mark or Matthew 9. And he said, if you become like a little child. Here's Toots and the Matel, sorry, saying, I'll never grow old until I find my love. And I just want to encourage us, don't get old. Don't get still. Don't get brought down. Always become like the child and go after Jesus. Go after the wonders of the gospel. Oh, let the gospel, let the beauty of the gospel penetrate your soul so you're as excited as a child to find out what is there. What more is there about God? Just like those in the call last night. My prayer is God, let them never grow old. Let them never get used to church. Let them never think they know you enough to where they, there's no more to know. Because all oh, the unsearchable riches of Christ, Paul cries out. He says they're past finding out. We can't get all. We can't grow all. Jamaica can't get all. In that you can't get used to being brought down and thinking there's no more hope. We can't. Jamaica, we can never grow old, meaning we can never grow weary in well-doing. For in due season, we will reap. I know we've seen lots of stuff happening around. And some of us feeling, when I say old, we're feeling the aches and weariness and fatigue and pain and something saying, give up. But I'm hearing toots and the may tells them, and I know it's not a gospel song, but me tell you, say, rooted in church. And they say, I'll never grow old. And I'm going to encourage us, don't get old in our thinking. Don't just say, ah, there's no hope for these young people. Go back and look at something like the call last night and let your spirit jump when you see them out there dancing and acting and singing and everything that they did last night. Wasn't that beautiful? You see, even if your body is aging, you don't have to be old. Your mind can still say it is possible. Your mind can still say I would have fainted had I not believed to see the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. Now I have to tell us there is an old song 
that helps us out with the same theme as Toots and the Metal. And that's the song that we sing in a hymn. It says, never grow old. So even when we die, we're not done enough. It said, never grow old. You may, those of you know it, never grow old. Never grow old. In a land where we'll never grow old. Oh, never grow old. Never grow old. In a land where we'll never grow old. So if you feel I say it all on Sister Janet McCann, but I listen to you, I say I'm tired. It's okay. God has a promise for you. There'll be a land where you're never grow, going to grow old. It's there for you. That's, that's in our red hymnal. But I want to return to this thing that the toots and the metals were singing. Don't grow old in your hope. It's church toots getting talent. Encourage, you know, something big on the young people. Encourage them. Encourage them. After I saw that last night, I said, God, may they never grow old. May they never stop dreaming. May they never stop seeing. May they understand that there are possibilities. Oh, Joel chapter 2 says, In the last days I will pour out my spirit upon all flesh. Oh, I know a lot of people love to tell me about the last days, all the bad. But I heard in Joel 2 where it says, young men shall dream dreams. Hallelujah. They shall have visions. Never grow old. Come on now. He says through the young and through the old too. He's going to give visions, dreams. Dreams is a longing of what needs to happen. Never grow old, man. Never grow old. So I just, let me wrap it up. I just want to encourage you to to see what the young people did last night in the call, you know. See how they dreamt. See how they performed because they believe in something. Let's not get weary. We had the funeral, as I said the other day in my last devotions, of the slain family. But never grow old, never grow weary, and never grow old. Me did love when Toots and the Mater sing it. And as I looked and I said, oh my goodness, Toots, I in church, Toots get him tuned from. So as we, our young people get in the tune these days in church, man, go ahead and encourage them, not true. You know, I always say that, go ahead and encourage them. Encourage them, encourage them, encourage them. To never grow old, all right? Never grow old. I just want to encourage you to encourage the talents. Let them, they, they, I pray there will be many calls. I pray that they will be performing for years to come. And that after them done, another group come up. And after them done, another group come up. You understand? That's what I'm praying. Let's not give up on them. I'll never grow old. Maybe there's a toots who was singing last night. And I pray that their song will continue. Encourage them. Father, I thank you. I thank you. I pray for those who feel like they're growing old. Who feel like they're just, they, they're just old, meaning they're just tired. They saw the slayings that happened. Um, in June and they're tired they, 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 they may hear the sound of young people and instead of encouraging them they, they may feel so tempted to say no can't go on you used to think like you know to give them back oh God that stirring that says I'll never grow old I will always hope and those who are the toots in the church toots they will be able to toots of the church and then give it and let it overflow to the world they won't have to leave they will serve and water the garden that god has placed before them and beautify the entire world so father i do pray for those who may feel old that they will never grow old and i pray for those oh god who may not feel old but then just don't know how to do it let them just let them just kind of get back in the music and 
and just pop a couple step. You know, let me just say this before I end. Every time I hear songs like these, you know, I think about my sister Shirley. Because may I tell you something, man? My sister, hey, hey, she was always stepping a tune. I don't know if you know that she got married the other day and we had them play some songs, you know, like these songs here. And um, <laughs> they tell her, we say, Shirley, show me a couple of steps, man. Show me a couple of steps. And sister put down some broke foot there along with her brother, Tim. But you see, them was determined so they now grow old. Because when them hear toots and the metals, them pop some foot and them have no fun. So I want to encourage you. You know, <laughs> sometimes when you feel like say nothing now go on for you, just dance before the Lord. Just say, God, me just go worship you. Me just go feel young. And if, if it's one foot, then just go ahead and move the one foot. If it's one finger, go ahead and move the one finger. Do something. Do something. Do something, all right. I probably <laughs> I beg you, do something and encourage you. Don't go, don't grow old, Pammy. Don't grow old. I mean, you're going age, you understand me. No, see me ramble today, but you're going age, but you don't have to, you don't have to give up. You don't have to, you know, cha. you don't have to just quit. You don't have to just done. There is hope. Never grow old, all right. Go ahead until you find your love. Go ahead until you find your love, all right? Okay, then. God bless you, you see? Walk good. Don't grow old. All right. Until then, next Monday, see you. Bye-bye.